Hey, hello and welcome back to our Diablo Hardcore Wizard playthrough. Let's continue, shall we? That no. Okay. Okay, let's go over there. Now we need to talk to him. Okay, let's look at this first. He needed to talk to the angel, ex-angel, I guess you could call him. Former angel. Oh, look at this. Okay, maybe we can re-roll that explosive. Damage or something that's actually useful. So, ah. So good. Because it's a slightly worse. Would say that, wouldn't you? Slightly worse. It does give me. As well, this is definitely worse. Thanks. So I have two rings. What does this do? You drain life. One time, I miscast the charm spell, and Sister Lysa was fawning over me for a fortnight. <laughs> it was mortifying. Okay. Knife. Nothing too good. Alright. So, I don't think I'm lacking in gold. So, let's uh, break up all these items. Why would I do that? Probably do it near the end of the I return every time it's your fucking inventory. Field, that's the problem, it gets filled way too often. Alright. Let's see if we can more of this. 
can I get more of that? I could. But I could not. Okay, let's try it once and see how it goes. Or life regeneration. It's actually the same fucking amount. So now I'm going to keep mine. Whatever. What about this? Uh, I think it was this one. Okay, life regeneration. That could, that's what I want, doesn't it? Yeah, that's more or less the same. A hundred experience, how much is that? It's a hundred experience per enemy. So if I kill ten, if I kill a hundred, it's a hundred thousand. That's in millions. Well, the other one has also more gold. I can reroll the. The yard pickups. I don't know how that works actually. Can I reroll it? No, I can only reroll the one I already have. Rerolled. So now. Lusa. Thousand life per second, so I can add up faster. Is that a good thing? I don't know. No, I don't think so. In millions of experience points, I don't think so. All right, let's see if we can get health regeneration out of this. And this, this is garbage. Ones are garbage as well. Alright, let's reroll this. Health regeneration, please. Low side. So again, I'm faced with the same shit. Looks low 600. Health regeneration to gain 1% extra damage. Nah, let's do it as is. Waste of time, but need it to be done. Now let's stop doing. Real. How do I repair stuff? Right. I have rid us of Urzael's tiresome existence. Without his leadership, the Reaper should be easy for Torian's men to finish off. You have saved Westmarch, my friend. But we're no closer to knowing Malthale's ultimate plan, and he grows stronger with each passing moment. Time is running out. That strange woman you brought here believes she can help. She insisted on speaking with you immediately. I wonder if she was truly an Asian to a game at this late stage, because I've known that woman for ages now. to find Malthale, but you will not like what I have to tell you. I rarely do. Why don't you just tell me? There is only one person who knows how to find Malthale. She waits for you in the blood marsh, and you know her well. Adria. Adria. Finally. It's Adria, the mother of 
the woman that got possessed by Diablo. I don't remember. Honestly, what's this dove icon? Stay in good health. Ah. Not love. You're not going anywhere without me. Oh, really? And why is that? Someone has to make sure you don't kill Adria before you find out where Malthael is. I shall try to restrain myself, but make no mistake, she will die. Okay. Let's see if we can. I have delivered the city of Westmarch from Urzale and his Reapers. The people are now free to rebuild their homes and their lives. Lorath and I depart for the Blood Marsh to find Adria. She, of all people, knows how to locate Malthael. I will take great joy in extracting that information before I kill her. <laughs> But now its heart has become twisted and sick, just like someone we once knew. Hilarious stuff. We hid the Black Soul Stone in the deepest part of the Nephilim ruins near here. We thought it would be safe, but Malthael found it all the same. Bloodthirsty, I don't remember. Maybe after angels betrayed her twice. The good guys. Away with you! Messaging the general chat could be interpreted in a very bad way. Alright. Let's see. Better backtrack. Five seconds alone, that's all we need. hulking beast with an exceedingly bad temper. Aided by packs of boggits, it will fight anything that crosses its path. Invariably, some of the boggits will die, but the survivors are rewarded with scraps left over from the boggins' prey. If only my assistance would work for so little. Or poisonous or something. Gotta take care not to step on them while fighting, I guess. This is the entrance to the tomb, but someone's collapsed it. Our friend, Adria. It looks like we'll have to find another way into the ruins. What was that? Something is coming. Yes. I want two chickens. <laughs> He's doing well. This was 
just one entrance to the city. There are guide stones littered across the blood marsh that will lead us to the main one. The guide stones are useless to most, but we'll reveal the correct path to a Nephilim such as yourself. Let's go. Time is always running out, so you can run, but I make it. But I will find you. Remember to get the information we need before you. Yes, yes. Information first, and then killing. Well, <laughs> that's not very reassuring. I guess he. Lives in a fair trial or something. Mm. Yes. <laughs> I think that freezes my ass. If I remember correctly. Uh, not today. Yeah, we're more the executioner type, he seems to be more of a lawyerly type. I am so good, I astound myself. I saw a witch. She burned. Father took me to the town square to see it. Look, he said, that is the face of evil. But she looked like any other woman, and burned like anything else. Then the flames engulfed her. Her eyes found mine, and she laughed. No wonder she... Grew up all messed up. <laughs> My father could never understand. He was born into privilege and wealth, and he spent every moment of his life trying to protect it. I was his flesh and blood, but he cared more about the names in books and the faces of the paintings on the walls than his living daughter. That seems illogical. If you're so well, maybe he was crazy, but if you're so obsessed with dy dynasty, with a dynasty, or your dynasty, then you would care Perhaps out the next generation. Do you know what fear is? The fear of who you are. The fear of what your own blood would do if they knew what you were. No, you could never understand it. People look to you as a savior. Have you ever thought about the lives you've taken? They were fathers, lovers, daughters. They were crazed cultists, demon worshippers, and assorted abominations, to be honest. Although I'm sure he got the fire of Ahadria, got ostracized or exiled or something for marrying a witch I'm sure the upper classes don't like that stuff okay so far so good but my shield is going to run out Onwards. Hopefully this is not a big map. It's not really a massacre. <laughs> The 
Better than annoying things. But yeah, usually wearing an undesirable ruins your reputation. Even if you plead some sort of, in the case of a witch you would plead she bewitched me or something. I was under a spell. They doubt people care that much. It's kind of the thing that happened to Voldemort star as well. And in that case he actually got reprieved. Because I guess the family actually cared about not losing the air. That was an enemy. Right, we have found the next step in our journey. But let's continue going around first. And then around. There is a max paragon early. Guess there won't be. After a while, how many you could put? So that's 200, 800 paragon would be the last time you level up. Something along those lines. Paragon, what would you get? Right through the middle. I see a burning man. I see a burning witch. I see terror and a hunger that will consume everything. What hope do the works of men have against such all-consuming hunger? I gave myself to the flames. Oh, what the hell? Uh, so she became nihilistic, basically. And decided to worship a demon. Reasonable enough. This is one of the guide stones. But nothing happens when I approach it. Please allow me. Because you're not left funded. My father burned. He screamed as the flames consumed him. And the smell was <laughs> delicious and sweet. <laughs> he had found me. For once in his life he had noticed me. And when he saw that the flames did not touch me, he breathed one word. Witch. It was his last. Uh, so parricide. There are four entrances to the Nephilim city, each one etched with a sigil. Only the correct one marks the true entrance to the tomb, however. When you activate these stones, one of the wrong sigils disappears. Then all we need to do is eliminate two of the remaining sigils. Yes. 
so Hedria killed her father and killed her daughter. I don't know the word for killing your father, parricide. Well, is it killing your own children? No, it's infanticide, but it's what any child. I wonder what it is. Holy fuck, God, they are in a tower. They actually die. <laughs> Yeah, you have patricide or parricide. You have matricide, I guess. Away with you. Leo would understand. We need answers more than we need revenge. Leo is dead. Consumed from the inside out. So, I guess we can dispense with her wisdom. How the fuck does he know Leah? Anyway. Some random monk from a place I've never visited before. Certainly Leah didn't. I think she was kind of secluded in that first area we visited. Tristram, I think it was. Along with dear uncle, whatever his name was. Stop being lazy, Loras. Go and kill something. <laughs> Standing next to me. I wonder if someone would consider this genocide. These things were living happily alone in their disgusting swamp. And then I decided to roll in and start killing them. For no reason other than some crazy lady said to come and live here. I don't know if this is the right passage. You know what? Wind passage eliminated. I think this is the wind passage, isn't it? Well, if I remember my fifth element sigils correctly, this is wind. I wonder if I should enter. Yeah, let's tiptoe inside. Why not? Shaman was created from the blood of the witch Adria. Because of that, the shaman is able to use magic and shields, channeling the power of blood and fire. Luckily, Adria only has so much blood to shed, and not for much longer. I need more arcane power. I've never been in these parts of the ruins before. We only followed the path that led directly to the tomb. Well, that is actually... What I should do if I didn't want to risk my neck, but... 
We've having gotten a good piece of equipment for a while. Well, maybe yesterday I got some legendary gloves. I think. What the hell? if those blue things will fuck me up. But whatever they are, they are incredibly vulnerable to fire. mind to explore the ancient ruins outside Westmark, and then I realized they were crawling with dreadful scarabs. Of course, these creatures do not frighten me, but they make my research much too time-consuming, and I am widely known for <laughs> my efficiency. Am I not? Stop her, boss. That's one way to mask cowardice. No, it will take too long. I wonder how that dude survived. Because he is obviously not a wizard nor a fighter. But he has explored more of the world than my own character, I guess. I have uncovered an obscure and ancient tome in whose pages is recorded an impossible tale. The secret history of a race called the Nephilim, gods by another name, and their ruinous civilization in the West. If this is true, how could all signs of these Nephilim be lost, but for the record of this single tome? Easy. Angels or demons destroyed them. Such a difficult mystery to unravel. How could demigods be destroyed? Ah, oh, it's true, there are gods all around. The size of this place. The works of the Nephilim are truly staggering. a few days maybe until I get to a mini boss or something if I yeah whenever I kill a mini boss or a boss I'll keep up up in the difficulty it's going to take any unnecessary risks Something along the lines. I saw a vision, and the old dudes in the temple didn't believe in my vision, so I decided to go to Tristram on my own. Pretty sure that was it. The backstory of this character. Hello, Nephilim. Oh. ridding our city of these cursed beasts. Okay. We'll do. <laughs> I don't 
something happens to my really drawn out first time in a really long time. First time in forever, I guess it's because those phantasms were floating and I wasn't hitting them. So I ran out of. I don't think I will be able to require all these artifacts. Pretty sure. Oh, look at that. Okay, still one corner to explore. What? Okay, there are the stairs. One corner to explore. Let's go and get it. Okay, we're going to let up the ceiling now. Don't even know what I'm shooting, but something is there. Well, did I get those items? Yes, I did. More life per hit, yes. So I actually don't have to worry about figuring out a build until I hit level 200 Paragon. I will keep putting points in the same categories. I'm not even sure I will be able to hit 200 Paragon. And there we go. The wind passage is definitely not the right end. Yeah, we already knew. Ah, this is the wave! Okay. Let me check the map first. Yeah, fully explored. Okay, wave. Tossing electricity around. A mighty foe okay. has fallen. I guess it was that dude. Okay, let's deal with the inventory now. Better now than later. The Boggin Slapper's snares are surprisingly effective, though I have no idea how they learned to fashion them. Most of the Boggins' feeble intelligence seems to be centered around killing and eating. Now I know which city marks the correct passage. The fire passage. Well, I will enter every passage if I can. Seems like a good way to level up. Alright, let's travel back to town. I guess we're still based in West March. But maybe not. I am returning to town. Time for inventory management. Hooray. The hell is this? Rare enchantress. Okay, you're the enchantress. 
Does it go up? Yes. Yes, it does. That's all I truly care, honestly. Alright, let's start with this. No. 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 Gems. Rare amulet. No. No, no, no. Okay. It says it goes, everything goes down. Rare chest piece. No. 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 Fire skills. Intelligence vitality. I get life per second. But every time you throw a recall object, you gain a short burst of speed. That's actually very good because it allows me to explore faster. So let's skip it. Now I lose toughness, I lose all sorts of things. Alright. Uh, critical orb. Nah. If ever I see my skin turn diamond, I know I'm in big trouble and should teleport out of there. Fire skills. Nah. No. 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 No, I think I'm going to sell all this stuff. I'm running low on funds. No, no, no. This is all garbage. It is. No. Alright, sell it all. Except the gems. Gems all. I need diamonds, which I foolishly used to craft that stupid fucking thing. Get it before it's All right. Find the wind passage and the other passage, whatever it may be. Losing health. I guess it was just a teaser, you could say. I'm actually, not supposed to. He's luring me in, I think. Okay. 
apparently not. Resplendent, radiant. I think the only stuff I've never done. Are they running to Mama or something? That's, no, they are not. There are no more places to run to. Us. It seems to me you're always thinking about the past. In one sense, I think often about what the future may hold, what adventures lie before us. The past is so distant, and the future such a mystery. I cannot help but wonder. Wonder how humans will fuck everything up. For that matter, angels. It seems to me in this mythology, angels have done more damage than demons. Searching for the maggot brood has been quite an adventure. I first observed the corpse of one near the road to Westmarch, where it raised such a stench that my new assistant vomited twice on my favorite traveling cloak. The stains came out eventually, but I was sorely vexed. Okay. Let's see, we can explore this in 15 minutes. Doubt it. So you have leap and wind. Holy crap. Alright. This is going to be ugly. I still don't see my health going down. To be honest. Don't even know how they died. <laughs> the hell did they die? <laughs> they all exploded suddenly. Alright. Movement, yes. Pastra I go the happier I am. This turns out is a very big map. <sighs> 
I am no longer scared of the yellow enemies. It's the blue enemies, holy crap, but that is kind of crazy. Nothing too good it seems. I wonder why they don't give me diamonds. It's always everything but diamonds. The leaf passage. This is not the right passage. Oh, they are not so stupid. They are clear enough to build those contraptions. Okay, holy crap. Alright. I think I'll have enough time to explore the main... But I am my health and try to kill these guys. and the, not the fire burst, the wind, wind and leaf, probably leaf first, tomorrow, alright, This is not the passage I am searching for. Very true. daughter had a child that needed to disappear, when there was a sickness that none of the healers could cure. Who was it they pleaded with when they needed me? The morality they flaunted in the daylight disappeared, as it always I need does. arcane power. What? They run out? I don't have my boosts. Kill the mage here. Okay. 
would have figured out again that she hates humans so much that she would have betrayed anyone that actually looked for help. That look, looked her up for help. Maybe she has witch pride or something. They want to make the reputation of witches even worse. As people that couldn't be trusted. But maybe a long term curse would suffice. Let's say something that would destroy your life in 10 years or 5 years. No one would suspect then. I went to a witch 10 years ago and now my life is going to hell. Doesn't sound very... ...credible to me. And I still no diamonds. No diamonds. This is the passage for which I've been searching. Well, do it for you. Holy crap, there is still a lot to explore. bit of arrogance, I guess it's warranted, yeah, that we have killed so much. Alright. Their falling comrade as bait. Oh, they are monsters. So it shouldn't be surprising. Based on real life. I don't remember in what war people actually placed bombs below the corpses of deceased enemies. Hoping they place the the corpse face down and placed a bomb below the body. Hoping people would come to the body, flip it to see who was dead. 
and then they will blew up and kill them. I don't remember which war it was. I know it's in the 20th century, so it must be either Vietnam or the Second World War. And is this dude? Zael, I am glad you are well. Who is this? I am Zael, a necromancer who seeks to maintain the balance. Class Hazar Haradrim. That's my friend Humbard. He's a skull. Please ignore him. <laughs> Zael helped Tyriel steal the Black Soul Stone from heaven. I did, but I was not in the tomb when Malthiel struck. If he was, Zael would have shown that angel what it means to cross a necromancer. That's enough, Humbard. Okay. Why are you out here? This place is falling to deep imbalance. Something is very wrong here, and I wish to heal the land. This bog is poisoned by the blood magic of a witch named Adria. I am going to kill her. Well, oh, that's taken care of. Let's go get a drink. Even after she is slain, equilibrium will not immediately be restored. It will take time. Always so serious. Okay, so no quest, no nothing. Alright, I'm in overtime, so let's finish exploring the grayed out areas. There are no bending tips or anything like that. And if no, then we should see each other tomorrow. But we will, I think, go to the leaf passage. I probably enter it to the. And then the other passage. Not the fire, or whatever the hell it is called. Leaf and... Wind, was it? Yeah, wind. And after that I'll enter. Please, Holy crap! Okay. Some random hobo. <laughs> and he does get a quest, okay, let's get it. And it kind of paid off to explore everything. People fleeing the city have been leaving all sorts of things behind. Is there maybe something you'd want? Well, thanks. So let's get to the leaf passage. Why not? And if the other locations get saved in the map, I'll come tomorrow. Let's keep all the encounters in the middle of the area and just go straight for the dungeons. Ah. Right, let's go. Leaf passage. Okay, let me now make sure no one has been kind enough. I wouldn't want to. Go on. Basically, steal someone's money. By not doing what I promised I would. Is there anything about the past you would like to know? Are there any ancient magic techniques that you could share with me? Okay, None that you would care check. for. Most of them are forgotten for good reason. Many would drive those who use them mad, or worse.
But yeah, I've been having fun so far. Pretty good game. No, alright, so thank you very much for watching, and I hope I'll see you tomorrow and we shall explore this leaf passage. Goodbye, and see you next time. Now let's do a portal there. I think I can. I am returning yeah, to town. All right, that's better. Yes. All right. Now I should be able to leave the game without issues. Yes. It's always better. All right. Goodbye. And thanks for watching.